not purely financial and manufactured, but it also consists of knowledge and skills, that's human capital, and it consists of nature, which is not made by man, that's natural capital, and it consists of relationships, both formal and institutional, which are the reason why this all hangs together, social capital. We use nature because she's valuable. We lose nature because she's free. This is also about the value of nature to society. In other words, nature's contributions to people or what we from the world of tea would call ecosystem services. They also very kindly provide us what kind of societal challenges they're talking about when they mention specifically water security, food security, human health, disaster risk reduction, and that's all about resilience, as in do you have a system which can respond to the buffeting of changing times and climates and come back to where it is, or will it just change phase and become a system in which humans can't live anymore. And then of course, last and not, certainly not the least, climate change. So these are the, uh, the societal challenges that the IUCN itself brings in in its definition of nature-based solutions. Mm -hmm.